and I went up and done a musical about Columbus. Except this isn't about Christopher, this is about Marvin, his somewhat loser third cousin twice removed. You'll never defeat us! It's too late, Margarita! It's uh, Marvin! Whatever. It's a story about a guy who's a little lost, can't seem to find his way. His dad sends him on a trip, if you will, to find something, to find himself. And we actually call it Columbus the musical Return to the Caribbean because he ends up finding himself on a Caribbean island. I arrived on the first day and they were like, you're playing Marvin, the lead in Columbus. I was like, am I? Marvin lives in the shadow of his very, very distant relative and uh, he suffers with like low self-esteem. I'm Emma Salvo. Uh, I play Shirley in Columbus. Shirley is a bit of a get up and go girl, apart from when it comes to her feelings for Marvin. She is besotted with him. It's 50 minutes of watching two people who are perfect for each other that just can't quite get it right, and there's a lot of crazy stuff in between. You're a singing shark! What the heck is going on? Just go with it, Betty, it's a musical. Royal Caribbean is famous for putting on big Broadway shows, but it's their first musical that they've written themselves. The main prop weighs five and a half tons. It's only about a foot shorter than the original one. It's the first time like a musical has a ship on a ship. We've had a bit of fun on a few shows. We have some great in-jokes. Obviously, this is Royal Caribbean's own production, so we've got some little jokes and tidbits here for, for our cruisers. Wow, after it's so fun! Actual excursions have gotten so clever. They're like, oh, pirates in the Caribbean! Uh, we're not pirates. The Caribbean audience will love it. It's kind of on a level on its own. It's a sort of surreal, split your sides laughing. All of the comedy isn't just in the lines, it's in the set, the costumes are ridiculous. The, ev everything about it is just so amusing. It's got a lot of Royal's heart in it. It's personal to them and I think the audiences will respond to that really well.